Alright, hello there everybody, it is Anaconda Squeeze, once again we are in Skyrim on the PS4. Today I've got two mods for you, uh, these are both by the original doll, they go hand in hand. Uh, this is the Changer of the Night's Player Home, and the Rebirth of the Followers Snow Elves mod that comes with it. So essentially what it's going to do is we're going to get a player home way up here in the north, and there's going to be a couple, or actually there's three, Snow Elf Followers that are going to spawn in this mod. So to get to this mod, you are able to fast travel right away. It is way at the top of the map here. It's going to be like in the ancient ruins. I think it ends up right being right over here. And then it's going to take you just kind of off location in the borderlands here. And we're going to head inside. Ooh, it looks like the Ice Age up in here. Very bumpy way down. Let's have a peek. Ooh, this is like, this is super cool. So we are getting access to this whole crazy ruins. It's all snow elf stuff. It's kind of fun, like there's lots of snow elf lore and it, it, there's lots of mods on it and this one actually looks really, really good. So that's why I, de I decided to test it today, because it, it did actually look like one of the few ones that seemed to know what they were doing. Let's run across here. Kind of sucks that to get in here we have to go through two doors, but maybe it's worth it. Maybe we're worth it too. Let's go! Ooh hoo hoo, look at this. Isn't that fun? That whole area is frozen over, that's pretty cool. Frozen over, frozen over. Funky, spooky tree. Okay, let's go inside here. Get some fun flowers. Here is one of the first of our followers. This is Luciel. Hello, Luciel, how are you? Divine smile on you, friend. Mm -hmm. Perfect, and you will notice that these people don't have the gray phase glitch. That's pretty cool, right? No gray face glitch, there's books everywhere, Afternoon. kind of all spread out. I don't want to read all these, but you guys can read them. You guys can just read to your heart's content. Okay, we're going to go this way first. Got a chest here, anything fun in here for us? Some random stuff. A little table here. Ooh, a bedroom. Is this our bedroom? This might be the master bedroom. What's in our chest? Nothing too crazy. I like all the blue. Like, it's super blue. Oh, and storage. Here we go. Dresser, dresser, dresser. To get anything with it is just going to be random stuff. Uh, apparently, we're keeping scrap metal in our dressers. Alrighty then. Heading over here. Let's go right. I chose right. Oh, this one's going to go on forever, it looks like. Oops. Is he going to wrap back? What's over here? Oh, we've got an altar over here we can activate. Let's do it. I don't have the required item. Oh, I remember. Okay, so you do need something. Actually, all right, you do have the altar there, and I will. Uh, I'll let you guys figure that out on your own here. I don't want to spoil anything. Oh, look at this! There are all these shrines in here. This is a really cool, like little like shrine room. We have a cute, cute, adorable little throne room here. Is this a uh, throne of holy lightning? That's pretty dope. All right, well, that's actually pretty sweet. There is... I saw a diary over here. So this is the diary of Soleil. This is one of the snow elves, actually. And apparently, like, there's a little bit of backstory here. So that the three brothers, is the followers here, Lucille, Soleil, and Glacial, they all sound like, kind of like evolutions. But I guess uh, Glacial's brothers hate him so much. Uh, younger brother, beloved brother, we love you so much. It must have been hurts, but it's necessary for us to see. Do this down as you're looking for. Busting the guns. Ooh, he's a vampire. I hope you, sleep, you can sleep with no worries in that cold, alone place, like your heart and soul now. Oh, okay. Alright. So there must have been a throne here, and he was buried under this tree. That's kind of funky. Well, he's alive now. And the fun part is that if you dismiss him near his brothers, they hate him so much, they will literally just beat the shit out of him. Okay, so we're going to go to the Garden of the Knights in a second. We took we took the wrong direction. We should have gone left first. Let's run over here. Oh, hello. Okay. Who is this? Mm -hmm. This is Lucille. Good afternoon. We already talked to you. Damn it. Mm -hmm. He's wandering around. I have lots of ingredients here. Got a fun little table with a few things of food. Okay, now down here, looks like this is our oh, potion room. Holy crap, potions everywhere. 
Soul gems. We got more storage. Storage is good. We like the storage. Uh, Elven War Axe of Binding. And then our enchanting stuff. Oh my. Lots of stuff. So it does come pretty actually. Like, it does come pretty stocked actually. That's not too bad. And up here we've got a weapon room. Okay, so we can a bunch of weapon racks for us here just to kind of store stuff. Damn, I really wish we came this way first. Now let's run back. Let's go to the gardens. <clears throat> ooh hoo 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 look at that. Okay. This is kind of a this is a really cool garden. What's in here? We'll stop by the mausoleum later. Let's just peek around it. Alright, this is like really funky. Can we get out here? I don't wanna like jump out here and get stuck. Oh it looks like we can. Okay, cool. Let's explore over here first. I kind of want to, do I go in the mausoleum now, or do I go in the mausoleum later? These are the questions I have. Let's explore the garden. What's that crazy deer? It was a weird pronghorn. That's hilarious. That's cool. We have a little, little animals running around our garden. This is just a really funky place. We can harvest a lot of this stuff. Okay, okay. I'm enjoying this. This is pretty cool. What's over here? This is really fun. Like, I'm really... Oh, boom. Look at that. We're going to take that. We're not going to not. Are those Daedra hearts in the tree? That is kind of creepy. It gives you Daedra hearts. Alright, well that's kind of fun. We have a tree that gives us Daedra hearts. Let's, uh, let's check out this Touch of Zephyr or whatever the hell it was. <clears throat> touch of whatever it was. I have way too much stuff. Like, far too much stuff. That's what I'm going to do one of these days. It's just ditch all my stuff. A charge attack that might paralyze an enemy for a long period of time. Okay, it's nothing too crazy. Hello, dear. <laughs> it, it, it turns deer into fainting goats. Oh my goodness. Hello. Oh no, he's just dead. Fine. Resist the paralysis. I don't care. Okay, let's go check out the mausoleum here. It looks like we're pretty much done down here for the most part. What? Spooky stairway. That's right. I was worried I'd need the, need the that spriggan knife, but we're good. That's pretty cool. So he was buried beneath this tree. This is the tree that he was put under. Hmm. Okay, so right now he is hidden. We could totally take him, but if we dismiss Until this guy time. by his brothers, they're going to beat the shit out of him endlessly, and it's going to make the whole thing all fucky. Okay, so let's try not to do that. Now... So there we have it, guys. This is your player home here. This is the Sh I think it's Chantry of the Knights, how you pronounce it. All these brought to be the original doll. I really just if you're gonna do one of these to do the other. Like, well, you can't get the followers without downloading the player home. But if you're gonna download the player home, definitely get the followers. Just check them out. Uh, again, just be cautious about ditching Glacio by them because they will just start an endless fight, I guess. Uh, I'll put the link to both these mods in the description below, so make sure you check them out. In the meantime, don't forget to follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, like and subscribe to this video. All that wicked awesome stuff. I do apologize for the delay that we're having over here on videos. Uh, I'm going through here trying to just make sure I get the best videos I can. There's been a lot of mods up that, not, not as much as there were in the beginning, but the mods are up right now. I'm kind of sorting through what's good and what's kind of not so good. Uh, that's why it's taking a little bit so long. That combined with Bethesda's uh, just server problems I've had in the last couple days. Uh, just kind of been slowing us down here, but we are going to keep videos coming out. Uh, at the very least, I'm trying for five a week here just to kind of get you guys at a steady pace. Uh, trying to keep a business week of these videos coming out. So until next time, guys, my name is Anaconda Squeeze. I will see you all fucking later. Bye.